What up, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm giving you a quick tip, the tip of the week, and this one is about Beehive, the email marketing service that I use. I recently switched from MailChimp to Beehive, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to embed a sign-up form on your website. The reason I'm sharing this is because it's a little tricky. At first, I couldn't figure out where to find like the HTML code to copy paste. The reason also that I'm showing you this is because if you go online, some of the tutorials and even some of the copy on the Beehive website is a little outdated because they've been constantly tweaking the Beehive uh, format and platform. That's one of the reasons why I love it. They're always updating things, but uh, here is an update. If you can't find it elsewhere, check it out. Okay. So you're looking at my Beehive dashboard here. Uh, you can see subscribers, open rate, click rate, all of that, whatever. But to embed uh, the signup form, first you're gonna go down here in the bottom left corner to this little gear icon. You're gonna scroll up to publication. You're gonna click on that. You're gonna see these menu items at the top. Over here in the top right, you're gonna hit subscribe forms. Now, you're going to have to create one of these to do that. I've already created this, but I'm going to show you. You're going to go to edit here. And here's where you can create the subscribe form. I named mine uh, sign up on website. That's just a name for you personally. That doesn't show up in your form. Uh, the header, your podcast haven awaits. That's like the hook to lure people in. Uh, my company's the podcast haven. It's a haven for podcasting. So there you go. A description. This is where you're going to write uh, something about your newsletter, like what it's about, maybe what they're gonna get for signing up, if you have any freebies, et cetera. Get creative with that. Input placeholder, that's enter your email. The button, I put subscribe. You can change the colors here. These are some brand colors. You can change the font, the size, et cetera, et cetera. After submission, you can have some additional uh, messaging that they get. I didn't do any of that. Anyway, that's where you create the subscribe form. I already did mine. You can see here, crush your content goals, sign up for a week, sign up for weekly tips and resources and grab your free copy of the four pillars of podcasting. That's an ebook I wrote about how to start, grow and launch a podcast. Here is where you're going to go to uh, embed it. You're going to go to view. Okay. And so this is what my form looks like as you build it you'll get samples as you start to update things. It'll show you what it's going to look like. In any case, this is the HTML code that you're going to copy into your newsletter or landing page. Um, this is for full width. I like to do full width. So that's like the full width of like the web page that you posted on. Um, you could do fixed width. You could do like a smaller one here and it shows you what each one's going to look like. The slim embed here, you could just see it's like basically just the button. Um, this fixed width is the same as the full width, but it's just like a smaller uh, display. In any case, you copy this code here. I select, you can't select all. That's <clears throat> a little bit annoying. So here, I'm going to slide this back and uh, kind of highlight copy. Instead of just selecting all, you got to do that. You're going to go to your website where you want to paste this HTML code. Okay, so this is what the form looks like. This is a blog post that I have about the best headphones for editing podcasts and YouTube videos. Um, and I put the embed form on all the articles that I write. And so here I'm talking all about headphones. Boom. They scroll down. You can type in whatever. Uh, and this is the blog post. Uh, now I'm going to show you if you're using WordPress. I don't know how to do this on any other platform. I use WordPress. Um, I imagine it's very similar. Okay, so here is where the post is af actually crafted in WordPress. This is just like typical WordPress blogging, but instead of visual, you're gonna go to text. Um, and then wherever you want this, you're gonna hit paste and paste it in. So for instance, mine is right here. Um, so let's put the cursor there. T hit text. Uh, the cursor is going to be where I last left it, which is right here. And this is the code. Uh, you can see here, Beehive Embed iframe uh, that I just copied over. And so that's how you embed a Beehive uh, subscribe form. First, you got to create it. Then you're going to copy that HTML. Then you're going to go to wherever you want your landing page, your web page, and you are going to post that in. And then it's going to display exactly how 
beehive told you it was going to display. Thank you for watching, guys. If you got anything out of that video, please subscribe. Going to keep sharing tips with you when it comes to content creation. This week was email newsletters and how to embed your sign up form. Uh, stay tuned for more tips and tutorials and resources from the Podcast Haven. Once again, I am Eric. Please subscribe, smash that button. Keep listening, keep creating, keep engaging. I'm out.